How's it going everyone? I thought I'd show you uh, my new 3D printed dust shoe for my ShopBot. Uh, so here it is mounted on the ShopBot. Um, it is a fully 3D printed dust shoe that mounts with a uh, kind of a collet ring here, which I'll show you in a minute. Um, it's got a magnetic removable uh, set of brushes. So these are on there with some rare earth magnets. Um, so it really makes bit changes um, really easy. When you're done with the bit change, just uh, snap this on there. And I actually have um, another one that's got a shorter set of brushes too if you're uh, using a really short bit. Um, the reason that I designed and built this thing was that my, um, this isn't really the stock uh, boot, but I had my machine came with one of these uh, Kent dust shoes. And this is a really good um, dust shoe. It mounts on the spindle like this. Um, and it exhausts at the front. But the problem is, what was with it, uh, is that I added an air drill um, to my shop bot, so you can see it here. And um, adding the uh, air drill made it so the exhaust for the Kent shoe was right here in the way. I couldn't turn the Kent shoe uh, to the left or the right, because if I turn it to the right, um, when we were at Y0, it would hit there, and when we were at X maximum, it would start to hit uh, things over here. So um, I tried modifying it and that um, that didn't work. So I ended up uh, coming up with this design here. Um, and I'll, I'll take it down and show you guys um, how it looks on the inside. All right, so let's go ahead and uh, take this thing off here. And I'll show you how um, it mounts on. So this is what it looks like, um, and essentially, you just clamp your air hose on like this, and I've done these sort of uh, flattened out style air hose, and put this magnetic base off the side. And this is the, uh, the collet ring adapter I was talking about, and I was looking for a way uh, to pinch really, really tight around the collet without having something that was like movable. Um, the Kent accomplishes this by doing this sort of uh, pinch ring. Uh, thing which works really well but as you can see even I um, I did snap mine at one point um, so I went with this this is printed in um, co-polyester uh, so it's got some flex to it and um, you can really bend these things you know much farther than you need they're only a um, you know a few thousands larger than the actual um, diameter of the spindle so what's nice is I just put this clamp on here um, and put it up and just give it a few turns and it's really really rigid on there um, this is a little tab that sticks up and on, on the shop pot there's a uh, bolt can't really see it but it's uh it's back there and you can tighten that bolt um it'll tighten against this so it's just one other thing uh that holds this on there um pretty tight and mounting it's really simple um basically just put it up like this tighten that um hose clamp that's in the back and tighten this bolt that's back here if you really want extra rigidity and this thing isn't going anywhere and then just take that and magnet it on there so this whole thing was printed in um, copolyester uh, so it's very sturdy it was about um, well many hours of printing I'll uh, I'll post that up but anyway there it is that's the um, the new 3d printed dust shoe